Haley was my first love. I've been in love with her since day one, since I first met her. She's a beautiful woman that I'd like to spend the rest of my life with, and all I'm trying to do is figure out if she's a cheater. Haley and I met in eighth grade, middle school. We was playing flag football, and after that, like, we started to hang out, we became best friends, and ever since then, we, we loved each other. We were high school sweethearts. Uh, we split up because uh, she was cheating. When I found out she cheated on me, it, it broke my heart. I was devastated. We split up, a few years went by, and we ended up getting back together. Well, about a month into our relationship, we split up for one day and she met this other guy and she says she didn't do anything with him sexually, but says she slept in the same bed. After that, I had my suspicions because it threw up red flags and she was just leaving signs everywhere that she was cheating. I was afraid of losing her. I fell in love with her all over again and boom, she broke my heart again. So one day I was cutting hair for some people and uh, I came home late. It was like one in the morning and I felt like I heard somebody walking down the steps while I was in the bathroom and the back door was wide open. So it led me thinking that somebody was in my house while I wasn't there. This has affected our relationship tremendously. Uh, we fight all the time, argue about the past. Uh, we're, we're always thinking one another is cheating and it's gotta end. I feel like she don't ever want me. And I'm not ever good enough for her. It hurts me, it really does. I just wanna be with her. I'm just afraid that there's somebody else and she's just gonna run away. Haley is the love of my life and I wanna spend the rest of my life with her. I wanna be the man putting the food on the table. I wanna be the man paying all the bills. I wanna be the man that's laying next to her, comforting her, loving on her. I wanna be that man, because I love her. I don't wanna lose her. My life is a living hell with him, okay? He, um, <laughs> we met in middle school, in eighth grade. Um, I mean, everything was fine. We were, I mean, we fell in love. I mean, I moved in with him. We were 14. I moved in you with him. You moved in together I moved at 14? In with him and his parents at oh, 14. You moved in with his parents? Yes. Okay. And we would get up, get on the bus, go to school. We would come home. I mean, everything was just perfect. And you were like a married couple at 14? Yes. Yes. <laughs> and nobody thought this was odd. <laughs> <laughs> Well, okay, so, I mean, everything was perfect. I mean, I mean, we were just so in love. I mean, we just, we were. <laughs> and, yeah, because uh, you're 14. Right, it's but it was just, It's fantasy land. Right, but we, well, I mean, we get to middle school, um, like, well, actually, we get to high school, and he, um, he starts, like, we just start fighting, and it's just not as perfect anymore. I cheat, he cheats, and... We argue all the time. When you say time. cheat, kissing? No, like actually sex. And of course. Yes. Yeah. But you weren't 14 at the time when you cheated, right? No, we were like 16. Okay, that's 17. a little better. <laughs> a little better. Um, so we split up, go our separate ways. Um, I had two kids. And at what age? I, like I have a four month old and 19 month old. So oh, oh, so recently. Okay. Okay, yeah. like in the meantime, we've been broken. I was like, ooh. No, 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 no. <laughs> In the meantime, we so broke up. I over. thought she was going to say middle school. <laughs> no, no. No. So, we broke up. I have two kids. Well, you have two kids with Larry? No. No. Oh, with somebody no. else? Yes. We broke up. Um, I was, we were about 18. Um, we split up for about four years, five years. Um, I had two kids in that meantime. Um, and about four months ago, we got back together. Um, the first month was, was wonderful. You know, I mean, we were perfectly in love again. I mean, it was just like we never, like, it was just perfect. So we're we, not going to talk about the past. Right, right. Well, then after that. Uh, um, why did it fall apart? Huh? Why did it fall apart? Um, he suspected that I was cheating on him. Were you cheating on him? No. 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 Why, did, why was he suspecting? Um, because well, he'd come home from work. He would um, check the closet. Right. Like, so he comes home. He's, uh, I got a little card here. He strip searched you. Yes, he has. Okay. Why would you agree to that unless he was wearing a police uniform? Okay. And, you know. Okay. Let's go in detail. Okay. And um, so it's about 11 o'clock at night. We're, you know, driving down the road. And I'm sitting exactly, I mean, I'm just sitting like this, in you know, car. in the car. And I mean, Sit my hands. On? No. No, that's not good. <laughs> hands, hands down. And all of a sudden, he jumps over and it's like, what are you doing? What are you doing? What While are you doing he's driving? There? While he's driving. 
while he's driving, pulls over. He's like, get out and take your clothes off. <laughs> I'm like, no. What, sitting in the car? I'm like, no, no. And he's like, take your clothes off. I'm like, no. So then it changes, and it's like, he wants to kiss and, you know, rub. And so then he wants to have sex in the car. And um, I was like, you know, so I took my clothes off. So he did manage car. to get the clothes off one way he or another. He did. Other. And when I did, the light comes on, the dash light. And he, he's looking at me. And I'm like, I went, then I what realized. What is he looking for? I don't know, a cell phone maybe? I, I get mad, you know, and I'm like, I'm not hiding nothing, I'm not cheating on you, like, you know, all this stuff. And so, anyways, I, we get our clothes on, and I'm, you know, we go did home. Did you have sex? Yes, we did. Oh, good. <laughs> yes, we did. Even and, though with all that, he said, I still want to have sex. <laughs> yes, we did. And then, you know, we went home. So was like, he happy then? I mean, yeah, like, it was just over. Yeah. Like, and, and, and then it's like a constant every day. Like, like one. we so. split up. Um, we split up. For a day? Yes, because he accused me of cheating and I was not cheating. Right. Um, I was at work, he went and got all his stuff out, and we were done. You know the Steve like, Wilkos rule, right? The what? The Steve Wilkos rule. What's that? When you break up, you gotta wait two weeks before you sleep with somebody else. I did not sleep with, I did not have sex with no other man. I did not. Did you kiss him? Yes. That's sex! <laughs> That's not sex. That is sex. <laughs> Are he you kissed. telling me if he came out here and kissed some girl right in the audience, would you get mad? Well, yeah. Yeah, because he's having sex with her, right? No, it's intercourse. It's sexual, it's sexual contact, right? Okay, okay. yes. So you, were make, so you break up, at the very day you break up, you're making out with another guy? Yes. Oh. You're a dirty bird. <laughs> what else is there that I don't know? Nothing. Nothing. Haley. Barry? Be honest. I'm honest. I'm being honest right now. Nothing. There's nothing else. That's it. You, you, so before you came here today, you didn't know about the day breakup and she went with her friend and kissed him? No, Steve, I didn't. Okay. Why, why did you pull the car over to strip search her? Because I thought she was hiding something. Right at that moment, as you're yeah. driving down the road, what, was, what did you think she was hiding? A phone. A phone. Yep. And so you checked all body crevices or what? I no, mean, I didn't do that. <laughs> um, you searched the closet for a secret phone? Yes, I have. What secret phone? I don't know. You, you've never found a secret I've phone? I've never found All a secret phone. Right. Haley took a lie detector test. And we asked her, you confessed to kissing and touching the male she spent the night with. Mm -hmm. I won't ask what you were touching. <laughs> Besides kissing and touching one male since getting back together with Larry in July, have you had sexual contact with any other men besides him? And she said no. Since getting back together with Larry in July, have you had sexual intercourse with any other men besides him? And Haley said no. Have you snuck men into the house to have sexual contact with them while Larry is not around? She said no. Have you had sexual intercourse with the friend you stayed with last month? She said no. And the results for Haley's lie detector test, they came back all the same. And they came back that Haley told the truth. I told you! Since you and Haley got back together in July, have you had sexual contact with any other woman besides her? He said no, and he did not tell the truth. Are you serious? Hold on, hold on, one more question. No, 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 no. <laughs> okay, okay, we're done. Right. We are done. All right. Since you and Haley got back together in July, have you had sexual intercourse with any other women besides her? He said no, and he told the truth. Oh. I don't care. I don't. He, but he did the same thing you did. Oh. No. On the same day. Wait, wait. On the same day. No, 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 no. No, you did not. Okay. I didn't tell you. You didn't tell me. You both came here. You both got your answers. If you're going to stay together, walk off the stage together. If you're not going to be together, walk off separately. There's no, there's no I don't care. You I don't, I don't too. care. I do okay. not care. You lied too. The same. I do not care. The same day. I don't the care. The same day that you slept with another man. All right. I don't care. I, I got. I went to talk. All right. Okay. Okay. She hugged me. What did my test results? I, I, I told the truth. A liar. Okay. You told You're the truth. Get I, out of my face. Because I didn't tell you at first. Get all right? out that's, of my that's face. That's the only thing I lied about. Get out of my face. Really?
I was raped. My name is Steve Wilkos, and I'm an investigative talk show host with a law enforcement background. It was my life or his. My job is to get truth and justice for everyday people. Watch our videos now.